I'm, I'm pretty picky when it comes to finding someone. So it makes it a little bit harder and a little bit more difficult, but I know that when that right person comes, it's going to make it so much sweeter and better. Obviously it seems like the show was a huge learning experience. And I assume you, you said you have no regrets. You wouldn't change anything, but does that mean, you know, the, the paradise dating scene just isn't for you? Would you want to go try that out or no? <laughs> You know, I had to shoot that one down. <laughs> I had to shoot that one down. I had a feeling down. you were asked. I had a feeling you were asked. I, you know, it's just, it's, it's not, I don't, unless God speaks to me and is like, hey, like, yeah, I, that is not something that I have in my mind or on my radar to do. Um, a bunch of my friends did it and, you know, had their experiences. But for me, I feel like, I felt like I was, and again, this is probably not gonna make sense to anyone until they read my book, but I felt like I was supposed to go on The Bachelor. Felt like I was called to be there, didn't know why, didn't know what it was gonna look like, had no idea it was gonna play out the way that it did. I'm grateful for that now, but you know, along the journey and through the process, it was crazy. Um, but now, you know, presented with the same situation, like, hey, do you wanna go do this? I just don't know that I would, again, unless I felt, kind of that piece again to do so. Um, I, I would love to meet someone the organic way. <laughs> I was gonna say dating post show, now gonna be dating post book, you know, not you, you right. get to know you pretty well if they wanna read the book. Is that harder or easier to have everything out there? It's definitely harder, you know, uh, no, not knowing, you know, what people kind of know about you, not know about you, their intentions. Um, so it definitely makes it a little bit more difficult, but, I mean, again, I'm someone who like knows exactly what, I know exactly what I want. I know exactly what I need. And so for me, I don't really waste my time just like talking to a bunch of people or going on a bunch of dates. Um, I can tell pretty quickly if it's someone that I would be interested in. I can tell pretty quickly if, you know, our vision and purpose for our life would align, if our beliefs and values align. And so I'm, I'm pretty picky when it comes to finding someone. So it makes it a little bit harder and a little bit more difficult, but I know that when that right person comes, it's gonna make it so much sweeter and better. And I mean, there's obviously always speculation and people talking about you now, cause you are on Bachelor Nation, as they say. Yeah. So, you know, I saw those photos of you with Mikey from Katie's season of The Bachelorette. <laughs> I wanted to know if there was anything you'd like to clear up there, Maddie. You know, I am not gonna, I'm not gonna comment on that. I will say Mikey is an amazing guy. Um, and I'm in a season right now of fully focusing on my book, fully focusing on, you know, where God has me right now. And honestly, don't think I could be in a relationship right this second, even if I wanted to, just because my life is so busy and crazy. But, um, but yeah, so I, I'm just really focusing on myself, focusing on this book and getting this message out there, trying to reach as many people as I can with this message. Um, and we'll just, we'll see what unfolds. We'll see what happens.